Hey everybody, I want to try something really quick. I learned a magic trick. I want to see if I can do it with you guys, okay? So we have here, totally normal deck of cards. Everything's different. Let's shuffle it up just to make sure I don't know where any of the cards are, okay? And then we're gonna pick a card. Only you will see it, I won't see it. And we're gonna see if I can, through the internet, guess what card you picked, okay? Pay attention, we're gonna do this all in one camera shot, so there's no trickery, okay? All right, so we have our deck of cards, it's shuffled, now let's split it up into three different groups. Got a group over there, group over there, and a group right here. All right, three different groups. Now, just to make sure I don't know where these cards are, we're gonna take the top card from every pile and get rid of it, okay? Don't need those, okay? It's not any of those cards. Now we need to pick a pile, but you're not here to tell me, so we'll just do eeny, meeny, miny, mo, okay? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a tiger by his toe. If he hollers, let him go. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. All right, middle pile it is. This is your card. Take a look at it, memorize it. I can't see it, I have no idea what it is, but you need to make sure you memorize it. Can you see it? Do you know what it is? All right. Keep that in your mind. We're gonna put it back in the deck. We're gonna put cards on top of it. We're gonna put cards underneath it. We're gonna take this deck, and you know what? We don't need this either. Throw it away. I'm gonna have to clean that up. All right, let me see if I can guess your card. I want you, in order for this to work, I need you to imagine the card in front of you. I need you to think about really hard what was on that card. You thinking about it? In fact, here's what I want you to do. I want you to imagine that you're holding the card right there in your hand. Just imagine that it's actually there. Some of you aren't doing it. In order for this to work, you need to actually imagine that the card is there in your hand. I need you to picture the numbers and the symbols that were on that card like it's actually in your hand, okay? You got it in your hand? All right, now I'm gonna see if I can reach through the internet and grab your card. So take your card, the imaginary card that you're holding, imagine the numbers and symbols on it, and I want you to push it up to the screen. Maybe you're watching this on a computer, maybe on your mom's phone. I want you to push your imaginary card up to the screen, and I'm gonna try to reach through the internet and grab your card. Are you ready? Are you holding it? All right, here I go. I got a card. Is this your card? Moment of truth. Is that your card? Welcome back to the Quarantine Games. So, due to the virus that's going around, uh, it's causing sports everywhere to be canceled. There's no sports on TV, there's no sports at school, and I, I thought to replace that, we would do sports in our house today. And the sport that we're going to play is football. Now, don't worry parents, I'm not advocating for tackle football happening in your living room. This is actually a, a tabletop game, and to be honest, it's, it's really not like football that much, but it's a lot of fun. Let me show you how we do it. All right, so all you need for this activity is a piece of paper, a little bit of tape, maybe some scissors, uh, and you need a friend or a sibling to play this game. So let me show you how we do it, okay? Take your piece of paper and you fold it in thirds. So you got three equal sections. And then you really only need one of these sections. So you need to cut one of these sections off. All right, don't need this. Well, maybe your siblings need it to make this, but this is all we need. All right, now you're gonna take this, and you're gonna fold in the corner. Keep doing this all the way up to the top of the page until you have a nice 
little triangle and then you take your tape. You just want to tape that closed. Way your tape is only on one side of your triangle. The other side is just paper. Okay? <clears throat> That's the first step, making your football. Alright, so let me show you how to play this game. This is my wife Anna, by the way. She's gonna be my friend to play this game today. So you take your football and you want to uh, slide it across the table. And the goal, what you're hoping to do, is to get it to hang over the edge without actually falling over the edge. Okay, so if it doesn't quite get to the edge, it doesn't count. If it goes over the edge, it doesn't count. You want it to hang over the edge and not fall off. So you just take turns, go back and forth, and when you get it to hang over the edge, that's a touchdown. All right, so we're gonna play. So close. Oh, not quite. Oh! I touchdown. got it! Touchdown! Alright, so when you score a touchdown, now you get a field goal. So, Anna, my wife, is going to hold up field goal posts like this, and I take the football, and I hold it like this, and then I'm going to try to kick it through the field goal for an extra point. Here we go. Oh, almost dropped it. Oh, I missed just to the right. So I only get seven points. And then we keep going and we play for about four to five hours quietly. And then whoever has the most points wins. That's all there is to it. I hope you have a ton of fun playing football. Send me a picture or a video of your game of football. I'd love to see it. You guys have a great day. I'll talk to you later.